Hey you guys, it's Farming Bananas Extra here, and today this is sort of a one off video, but it's also the start of a new series I plan to do. It's on a module called TK Inter inside the Python 3.3 platform. And basically, what TK Inter is, it's an application that allows you to make windows or frames inside of like whatever operating system you're using with Python. There are a couple of other modules and stuff that can do this, but this is the pretty much the easiest one. Like there's Pi game which is used for game development and that I just couldn't be bothered to learn really. And there's WX Python which is quite an easy module to learn, but it's only supported up to two point seven at the moment I think. So I couldn't get a three point three point two so I decided to just stick with TK in there, so for now. So anyway. If we open up this quickly, which is my little test file in Eclipse, make sure you get it on Eclipse. If not then doesn't matter, but try to get it on Eclipse. Basically, all you want to start with is the start line for all these TK into um, uh, like code pages. You always have to import um, sys first, which is like the system module. After you've imported that, you can use from TK into import or always put simple import, and then a little star at asterisk to um, import everything from that particular module. Uh, so once you've got this sort of thing do, done, this is sort of the housekeeping stuff, you need to remember this, you need to pretty much do this for every single application you make. Obviously you'll be adding more libraries and stuff to this later on, but for this tutorial this is fine to work with, so it doesn't really matter. Now what I want to do is create an object uh, that we can reference when doing our, like, sizing our windows and making labels and stuff like that. So I'm going to make one called app and I'm going to set that equal to uh, capital T, K, and then two parentheses, which is a uh, T counter frame, I think. And then all we want to do after this, now we've got our two imports and our um, frame declared here. All we want to do is just use our um, frame name, if you would like, and we want to type in geometry. And basically what you're going to put in here is whatever size you want your window to be in quotations. So say 600 uh, by 400 uh, for the size of the window. Yeah, this 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 just that would be fine for the size of the window. Now, I'm just going to run this and add some stuff in a sec. All you want to do is for window machines, window operating system machines, all you want to do is type app and then main loop basically what this does is it just keeps looping around and refreshing the window otherwise what happens is it runs the window once and then it just closes it but for windows machines you have to put this in i think for linux you don't and for mac i have no idea you might have to you might not uh... but i don't know at the moment i'm just going to save this and run it as you see here we have a window which says tk for the title but let's change that in a minute and we just got a uh, 600 by 400 window size. Uh, you can X out full screen all this stuff, all the stuff you normally do on a default window. I'm just going to X out of this for now to stop the application. Now, as you see, when I ran this, let me just run it and click it. It appeared at this section of the screen here. This is default, I think. The top left-hand corner. It's a certain amount across and down from the top left-hand corner. But we can change this simply by adding here. What we want to add is plus, and then however, like how many pictures you want to um, bump it. For, it's like x y coordinates, so just put 200 and 200 just to test. Let's run this. Now you see it appears 200 across, which is x coordinate, and 200 down from the left top corner of the screen to the left top corner of the window frame. So you can use this, and you can make it appear right in the center of your screen, or you can make it appear bigger and stuff like that. Keep that in mind because you need to do this in every application you make. Another thing we can do is just quick, I'll quickly show you is just main dot oh, oh, object dot title. And when you put in title in quotations goes whatever you want the title of the app to be. So you see saw before the title was TK. Now we just take this to um T into YouTube test up like that and now if we run this 
You see the title of our screen, or frame, is Tekens a YouTube Tester. Now we'll learn in the next tutorials how to put stuff within this section here, buttons, frames, how to use grids and stuff like that. But for now, remember this code here, because this will be stationary code you need to include in pretty much every application. But that's about it today, guys. And with this T-Kit and stuff, I'm pretty much learning with you, because I've only started learning it about I don't know, a week and a half ago or something. So I know a bit more than I'm teaching at the moment, but I'll be learning mostly with you. So yeah, if you want to see more of this, just like up the video or leave a comment um, saying, oh, I want more of this and stuff, and I'll do more. But yeah, that's about it for today, guys. So hopefully I'll see you next time in the other T-Kit tutorial. And uh, that's it, so bye.